Good night, teacher. Hello, good night. Welcome to the class. Welcome to the class. Thank you. Good night, good night, teacher. Hello, good night. Welcome to the class. How are you, ladies? How are you? Thank you. How are you? Good, good. Fine. Nice Thank to you. hear that. Nice to hear that. Mostly because today is the last day of class. Tomorrow you have vacation. Saturday you have vacation. Yeah. <laughs> Sunday you have vacation. And Monday you have vacation. Monday. Very long vacation. Very long weekend. Esta sí va a ser un, un fin de semana largo. Very Monday. long weekend. For you. For you guys. Why? Because those the, the November Dia de Difunto. Oh, really? Yes. <laughs> Thank you. You guys have fun. Disfruten este fin de semana larguísimo. Okay. Thank you so much. You know what I, I enjoy about this um, date? Lo que me gusta disfrutar de estos días is because, uh, well, uh, many people, they do one thing that I like is miel de ayote. I love it. I love miel de ayote. Miel de ayote. You don't know that, Lydia? No sé, no sé qué es miel de ayote. Oh, come on. Ayote en miel, ayote en dulce comemos aquí. Ayote. Oh, ayote. Yo qué dije, yo qué dije. Miel de ayote. Yo así le llamo miel de ayote. <risa> ah, bueno. No, es dulce de ayote. Ajá. Uh -huh. <risa> ok, yo siento como miel, I don't know, I love it, I love it. So, sí. um, so I rico. like it, I like it very much. Ya me trajeron dos platos. Oh, I love it. So, me gusta el ladito con, con un litro de, de, de leche. I love it. Yes. Ah, yes, yes. Bueno. Bless you, Claudia. Bless you. Thank you. Okay, so, everybody, you guys should be happy tonight because you're going to have a very, very long weekend. You're going to sleep like a bear. You're going to go, go to hibernation. Se van a ir a hibernación, hibernation. You're going to be like the osos polares. <laughs> okay, so let's see who's coming next. Veamos cuántos van a, a venir. I have 12 students. Por el momento solo tengo 12 estudiantes. 12 estudiantes. 12. There it is. So. Um, are you guys planning something for this long weekend? Van a planificar algo para este fin de semana larguísimo? No? Mm. Maybe? I don't know. Only work teacher. Work? Why? Come on. Go out and have some fun. Salgan y diviértanse. You know, life is too short. La vida es muy corta, so you need to go. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I like about El Dia de, de los Muertos is that I go and get Elotes Locos. Everywhere they have Ojuelas. Elotes Locos. Oh, no, Ojuelas, no. Maybe Elotes Locos y Enredados. Enredados? Enredados? That's how you call them? Enredados. Oh, I love those Enredados. Tostaditos. Very good. Nice. You really like nice. Hello, good night. Welcome to the class. Irene, I cannot hear you. Irene? Your microphone? Is it yes. good? Oh, yeah. Now, now okay. I can hear you. Yeah, yes. yes. Welcome to the class. Thank you. Good night. Hey, hello, good night. Welcome to the class. Thank you. Yo ya les estoy preparando hasta un viaje por este fin de semana largote que van a tener. Diviértanse. You have to, you have to, you know. Bueno, diviértanse por mí, porque yo no me puedo hacer nada. So, solo digan, oh, me voy a divertir por el teacher. <laughs> <laughs> ¿No? ¿O sí? I don't know. <laughs> uh, sí, van a tener um, viernes, sábado, domingo y lunes. Eh, casi una semana de vacaciones, qué envidia. Viernes no, viernes se trabaja todavía. No, de mí, descansa de mi clase. Ah, ah verdad, Marisa, hasta se ríe, mire, ah, nos deshacimos del teacher. <risa> <risa> ok, no, guys. 
Ok, va, veamos, tengo 19 estudiantes. Quería que estuvieran más, pero comencemos, no perdamos tiempo. Let's go. Um, voy a compartir la PowerPoint presentation. Me avisan si la ven. Good morning, teacher. Ana. Hey, good morning. Hey. Good morning. Durmió I'm toda crazy. la tarde. Durmió toda la tarde. Está oh. bien. Se echó un nap. ¿Qué es un nap? Ah, es un este sí, está. como. ¿Mm? Sí, está. Durmió ajá, la tarde. Ajá. No, teacher. Anduve en el, en el cementerio. Ah, ok. Uh -huh. okay. Eh, but my mother uh, eh, has eight days that when that she wants pass away. Oh, so sorry. Mm -hmm. So sorry to hear that. That's, that's, yeah. that's not really good. So sorry. But I need to use to live with this situation every day. Will I be know. Changed. It's very hard. And I hope. Yeah, it's very hard. It, I was crazy when, when I lost my grandmother. Uh, my grandmother was like, mi niño chiquito. She, she was always like telling me. So I miss her so much. I missed her. I was like, so sad, yes. so sad. I, under, yes. I, I understand how you feel. I understand. My yes, condolences to you and your family, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay. Yesterday, I couldn't, I couldn't participate in your class because I was no good. I was feeling bad. I understand. And I needed need time for myself, but now I am better. <laughs> thank God, thank God, you know? Okay, bye. And whatever... You know, if you don't feel like, like participating, don't worry. I understand, okay? No, no. Oh, right now, I'm, I'm good. You. No, I am good. The life is continuing every day. Okay. Okay. Good. Okay. Okay, guys. So, as you can see, I'm already um, uh, sharing my PowerPoint presentation. And do you guys remember where we left off? Donde nos quedamos ayer? No? Okay. Let me know. Avísenme. Here we go. A la carrera. Look. <laughs> Fast forward. -da -da. Oh, we did that. 1.9. 1.9. Oh, thank you, Angel. There it is. 1.9. Mm -hmm. Es elusivo, uh -huh. ¿verdad? Yeah. Sí. Me acuerdo porque alguien se equivocó con la laguna de Aramuaca. No podía decir Aramuaca. ¿Qué tipo de nombre es ese? What kind of name is that? Nahuatl. Very good. Thank you, Angel. Hey, Angel, lleva 10 ya. <laughs> okay, so, so it's now what? Now what? Okay, so, bye. Right, continuemos entonces. 1.10. Nos fuimos al 1.10. Achievement indicator. In this session, modal verbs can and should will be taught in order to ask and answer questions. Everybody reading? In this session, 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 in answer session, in question. session, in this 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 session, in Can, son dos, should y can, veamos. Lo cual también les agregué la gramática, porque tenemos que ver la gramática de eso. Ok, everybody, what can we do during the weekend? 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 When can we do during the weekend? We can go out and have fun. We can go out and have fun. We can get up late and stay home. We can get up late and stay home. What is something you can't do during a class? What is something you can do during a class? Voy a hacer una pequeña pausa para explicarles algo, eh, para que no se equivoquen. Y es que en positivo usted dice can, can. Pero en negativo, porque tenemos que enfatizar, enfatizar de que hay apóstrofe T, vamos a decir can't. 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 Positivo, can. 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 
y negativo okay. can't. Can't. Okay. Can't. Okay. Can't. Positivo can y negativo can't. can't. ¿Me entendieron? Yes. yes. Excellent. So continuemos. What is something you can't do on during a class? What is something you can't do? Es negativo. Can't. Can't. Uh, no can. can. Es positivo, recuerden. Can. What, what is something you can't do during a class? What is something you can do in a class? You can't, you can't eat any food during a class. You can't eat any food during a class. Okay. La pronunciación en positivo es con C, can. Pero la, la respuesta negativa es con K. Can't. 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 What should we do in an emergency? What should we do What should we do in an emergency? What should we do in an emergency? In an emergency. In an emergency, we should call 911. In an emergency, we should call 911. What is something we shouldn't do in an emergency? What is something we shouldn't do in an emergency? What is something we shouldn't do in an emergency? What is something we shouldn't do in an emergency? Do it an emergency. We shouldn't panic during an emergency. We shouldn't panic during an emergency. We should panic during an emergency. We shouldn't panic during an emergency. Good. Okay. And uh, we're going to do one practice with, uh, with, um, like, um, like multiple slides. So take the screenshot for this one. This was. This is going to be the first one. Take a screenshot. A screenshot. No. Don't worry, I'm giving you time. Take it, take the screenshot. Yes. Got it? Good. So in this case, we were talking about um can and should. So let's go. Let's move on. So, como estábamos hablando de can and should, le voy a presentar la gramática. Okay. So in this case, just listen to me and then you repeat. Escuchenme a mí y después ustedes repiten, ¿ok? Listen. Can. Motor verb can. Can is a motor verb. Can is used to express ability or to say that something is possible. Can is the same for all subjects. We don't add an S in the third person like other verbs. ¿Todos leyendo? Modern aunque a veces dice acá de que el verbo can, porque solo en sí es habilidad, demuestra habilidad, pero también puede ser utilizado como verbo auxiliar. Aunque dice que no funciona como otro verbo que se le tiene que agregar la S al final en el presente simple. Sí, este no, en este no. ¿Ok? ¿Preguntas? No. Well, good. Ok, good. Moving on. Listen, listen. The verb that comes after can is the infinitive without to. I can speak English equals it is possible for me to speak Spanish equals I have the ability to speak Spanish. He can sing, he can swim well. We can see our neighbor in the garden. 
they can play the guitar. Everybody reading? Well, we can see all the people in the the Very good, thank you. So, as you can see, lo que dice acá es que después de can, el siguiente verbo no va a venir con el infinitivo to o preposición. No lleva el to, va a ir solo. Como ven en el, en, en el ejemplo, he can swim well. Él puede nadar bien, no lleva to. No se puede decir he can to swim, no. So, mm -hmm. va a decir, no va a llevar el to. Ok, any questions? No. Están, en, están entendiendo hasta el momento. No se me queden con dudas, por favor. ¿Ok? No. Good. Let's move on. Continuemos entonces. Let's move on. Listen. 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 Negative. To form the negative, we add not after can to form one word. Cannot. We can also contract the negative to form can't. Can't equals cannot. I cannot play the piano. We can't go to the cinema tonight. She cannot speak French very well. He can't drive a car. Everybody reading? Negative. Good. Okay, when you are not 100% sure that you're making the correct pronunciation, you can use cannot. En negativo, si usted no está um, 100% segura de que está, o seguro, de que, no es, de que está pronunciando bien el can't, entonces puede decir cannot, que es el negativo también. So podemos decir cannot, or can't, okay? Okay. Very good. Preguntas aquí? Okay. No question. No, no question. Todo está entendido? Yes. Okay. Is, yes. Is, For is, me, yes. Is everything clear like the horchata? <laughs> Maybe. Like water. Eh, no sé por qué a esta hora me da de, no. de comida y bebidas. No sé por qué. <laughs> Do you have hungry? I'm hungry, I guess. Forever gordito, anyways. Okay, let's move I'm on. I'm hungry, teacher. Uh, todos, creo. <laughs> okay, veamos que sí. Listen, listen. Questions. To form, to form the questions, we change the position of the subject and the auxiliary verb. The main verb is still in the infinitive without two. Where can I buy an ice cream? Can I go to the party, please? Can you speak Japanese? <laughs> what can we do on Saturday? Remember that you can use short answer. Can I sit here, please? Yes, you can. Can you speak Chinese? No, I can't. Everybody? Question. 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 The question we can I can Ok, so aquí realmente lo que dice es está el sujeto y el auxiliar está, los ponen en diferente posición. Vean dónde está el sujeto, casi en medio. 
where can I, where can I buy an ice cream? Así es, es cambian de posición, ¿ok? Teacher. Yes. Do you only send us when we are talking? Uh, all people are talking. Yes, yes, yes. That's <laughs> do, you, why... do you understand us? Yes, that's why I make corrections. That's why really? I, I can pick them <laughs> and say, mm, he's not mentioning very good. Yes. Okay. <laughs> and also, uh, you know that. I need to close my window. You need to. Oh, because it's, it's raining. Rain. I know, I know. Yes. Right. Go, 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 go. Okay. Um, preguntas hasta el momento? Any questions? Uh, pronunciation de Japanese. 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 Thank you. Es el gentilicio de los japoneses. Japanese. Okay. Japanese. Yes. Okay, moving on. Oh, terminamos con Ken. Este es el mo modal Ken. Veamos la práctica. Let's go. Let's practice what you know. I blame speak French. I picked it up while I was in French. What is the correct answer? Ken. La uno o la dos? Uno. 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 I can speak French. I picked it up while I was in France. Todos? I can speak French. I was in French. I was in French. I can speak French. I picked it up while I was in France. I can speak French. I was in French. I was in France. Good. Question? Questions? Speak now. What is. Mm, what? No, it's number one. Number one. Really? Yes. Teacher. Porque la primera oración termina. Speak it up es lo aprendí. Es una forma de decir. Ah, yeah. Okay. Lo aprendí. I picked it up. Teacher. Yes. Diga. It up. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Junta las dos. I picked it up. It. Las tres se juntan. Pick it up. I picked it up. It up. I picked it up. I picked it up. Pick it up, pick it up, pick it up. So it's number one. Pick it up. Number two, I blank come to the party. Um, I am really busy. What is the correct answer? I can't. I can't. I can't. I can't. Number two. I can't. Number two. I can't come to the party. I am really busy. Todos? I can't come to the party. It's really easy. We blank hear you. The music is too loud. We can number two. Number one. Number two. Number two. We can't hear you. The music is too loud. Oh, vean lo último que dice. La música está muy alta. So, that is loud, loud, teacher. Loud, loud. Like, like, uh, if it's like me, I, yeah, I can't hear you because it's raining. Uh, yeah, because the raining is too loud. Teacher, what is loud? Loud, loud. Es fuerte. Alto. The music loud. is too loud. La música está muy fuerte. Muy fuerte. De, o sea, ruido. Okay. Where are my keys? I blank find them. Where are my keys? Number two. Number two. Can. Can. Where are my keys? I can't find them. So I can't. Where are my keys? I can't find them. I can't find them. I blank give it. We want two dollars. I can. I can. Number two. Number two. I can. Number two. We want two million dollars. Everybody. I can. I can. believe it. We want two million dollars. We want two million dollars. Okay. Terminamos con Ken. Pero como estábamos hablando de dos modales. El primero fue Ken, ahora vamos con el segundo que es should. 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 Okay. Should. So, listen, listen, listen. 
should is a modal verb. After should, you use the base form of the infinitive equals verb without to. E.g., go instead of to go. Should plus verb form of infinity. Base from G, you should go now. Do not say you should to go now. Um, everybody, ready? Ok, guys, um, tienen que repetir, eh, estoy hablando con los que tienen apagado el micrófono, o sea, los estoy viendo aquí, por favor, esta es la práctica, chicos, si no, no, no lo hablan, no lo van a, no, no lo van a poder hacer. So, ok, um, any questions here, preguntas acá? No. Instead of the book. Instead of little, e.g. example. In, in, in example. In example. Eso es lo que significa e.g. E.g. Mm -hmm. In examples. E.g. Mm -hmm. Okay, good. Listen, listen. Should. Mm. Want to give advice. A recommendation or a suggestion, this is to say that it is the right thing to do or the correct thing. Does your tooth still hurt? You should make an appointment with the dentist. I think you should study for the test so that you don't fail. Your hair is too long. You should get a haircut. You really should go to the restaurant on Main Street. Todos? Sure. Bien, entonces uno de los usos que tiene Shield es para dar, eh, para aconsejar, para dar consejos. En este caso, does your teeth hurt? You should make an appointment with the dentist. Si te todavía te duele la muela, tienes que hacer una cita con el dentista. Es un qué? Consejo. Se usa para consejo. Questions? Suggestions? Sugerencias. Sugerencias. Okay. Any questions? Okay. We're good. Oh, wait. What? 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 Ok, muy bien. Tú, esta es la, dos. La, la primera forma es de dar consejos o sugerencias. Veamos la dos. Tú, expresas que la situación es likely in the present. Mary should be at home by now. Give her a call. He should have the letter by now. I sent it a couple of weeks ago. Three, expresas que la situación es likely in the future prediction. They should win the game because they are a much better team. I posted the check yesterday, so it should arrive this week. It should be fine tomorrow. Everybody? Okay. 
by tomorrow. By tomorrow. Mm -hmm. Very good. Tomorrow. Okay, as mm -hmm. you can see, number two, la número dos, que también se puede utilizar para las situaciones que pueden ser en el presente. El ejemplo, Mari should be at home by now. Mari debería de estar en casa en este momento. Eso es el presente. So, entonces, se usa, se usa para situaciones que pueden ser en el presente. ¿Ok? Y número tres dice, expresses the situation is slightly in the future. Puede ser una situación que se puede dar en el futuro, como una predicción. Ejemplo, they should win the game because they are a much better team. Ellos deberían ganar el, el partido porque son un mejor equipo. Entonces, es como que se está prediciendo por lo que se ve. ¿Ok? Questions? Likely. No, what is? Likely. Likely. What is it? Oh, yeah. Express the situation that is likely to be the future. Que esto sería como una situación que debería o estaría siendo en el futuro. Ok. The pronunciation of check. 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 Como con K. Check. Lo mismo que en español, check it, check. en la E, check. Ok. Ok, cool. Es eh, como cuando estamos jugando um, a ajedrez, pues de checkmate. Es la misma palabra, checkmate, check. Ok. Pronunciation complete, teacher. ¿Cómo? Pronunciation complete. ¿Dónde está? ¿Cuál es? Apple. No, no, no. La copla. Capol, capol. Capol. Couple. 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 Oh, yeah. He should have the letter by now. I sent it a couple of weeks ago. A couple. También couple por sí solo significa pareja de novios o de esposo. Couple. Okay? Good. Moving on. Continuamos. Four. Listen. Four. Expresses an obligation that is not as strong as must. Bless you. Sometimes should be... Well, sometimes should is used instead of must to make rules, orders, or instructions sound more polite. This may appear more frequently on formal notices or on information sheets. On hearing the fire alarm, hotel guests should leave their room immediately. <coughs> Passengers should check in at least two hours before departure time. You should never lie to your doctor. You should pay more attention to class. You should be at work before you. everybody. Express an obligation that is not Okay. Okay. Ok, so, el número cuatro dice que es una obligación, pero no tan fuerte. Es una obligación, pero no tan fuerte. O sea, como por ejemplo, um, deberías de estar en el trabajo a las ocho. O sea, es obligación, pero puede ser de que me agarre el tráfico y llegue tarde. No se cumple. No se cumple, correcto, correcto. No es tan fuerte como el más. El más, sí. Ese sí es obligación que tiene que, que quedarse de una u otra forma. ¿Ok? ¿Questions? ¿Preguntas acá? That is information sheet. What is? What? Information sheet. Information sheet. Páginas de información. Páginas de información. Sheets. La pronunciación de... ¿De cuál? De hotel, la palabra que sí. Ah, hotel guesses. Hotel guesses. Guesses. Guess. Singular. Invitado. 
guest singular, guest es plural. Okay? Invitado. Yes. Huéspedes. Teacher, no, no invitados, huéspedes. De... huéspedes. Okay, la otro? pronunciación de la pronunciación de donde dice this may appear this may appear 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 this may appear, appear. okay good moving on mm -hmm. five listen listen five was expected in the past but didn't happen should plus have plus past participles this expresses the idea that the subject did not fulfill their obligation in the past or did not act responsibly. You should have given your boss the report yesterday when he asked for it. I should have studied more, but I was too tired. Lean a cinco todos. Okay, so in, in five, dice que eh, era algo que se esperaba en el pasado, pero que no sucedió. Y se utiliza como should, más, have, más el pasado participio. Okay. Y esto expresa una idea de que el sujeto no cumplió con su deber. ¿Ok? Ejemplo. You should have given your boss the report yesterday when he asked for it. Deberías de haberle dado el reporte a tu jefe ayer cuando lo pidió, indicando de que él no le dio el reporte. ¿Claro? Yes. Good. Ok, yes. vamos al número 6. Six, not fulfilling an obligation. Should plus be plus bear ing. This expresses the idea that the subject is not fulfilling their obligation or is not acting sensibly. You should be wearing your seatbelt. The person isn't wearing one right now. We should be studying for the test. We are not studying right now and we should. Everybody reading? Not Ok, este es igual que el número 5, ok, que, que el sujeto no cumplió con lo que debía de hacer, pero además se le agrega algo más, que no es sensible, o sea, que no, no toma en cuenta los sentimientos de la, de la otra persona. Ok, eh, so, eso es lo, igual, nada más que no es sensible. Ok, preguntas, any questions? What is fulfilling? Fulfill, fulfill. Eh, no hacer lo que debe de hacer. No cumplir con algo. What is feedback? What is what? Feedback. Seatbelt. Seatbelt. Oh, seatbelt. Uh, when you go in your car, you put your seatbelt. When you go, when you go driving, you put your seatbelt. What is seatbelt? Cinturón. Cinturón. Cinturón de seguridad. Yeah, very good. Any other question? Yeah. Uh, ¿Cómo se pronuncia fulfilling, teacher? Fulfilling. 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 What does that mean? Teacher, I have a question. Que dije que era fulfill. Ángel, Ángel, ¿qué es fulfill? I didn't hear you. Angel? No cumplir con lo que debe hacer, dice. Yes, yes. Oh, uh, si lo pone en negativo va a ser did not fulfill, pero si lo quiere poner en positivo puede decir yes, I fulfill, yo, yo cumplí. Oh. 
¿Sí me entienden? Mm -hmm. Se puede utilizar mm -hmm. tanto en negativo como en positivo. ¿Ok? Sí, yes. Este, eh, I didn't understand the number six, six, but I didn't catch the idea. You said that when the other person don't take a feeling. Yes, no, 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 no,
You shouldn't leave without saying goodbye. He shouldn't play with those wires if he doesn't know what he's doing. Are you tired? You shouldn't work so much. You shouldn't talk like that to your grandmother. Everybody reading? Shouldn't. 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 Good. Any questions? Yes. Uh, without those wires, with it. With with those wires, alambres or cables. Okay. Pronunciation the 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 spelling that you shouldn't leave. Throw, throw. La tercera. You shouldn't. No, la primera. Oh, you shouldn't throw. You shouldn't throw your litter onto the. Street. ¿Qué es litter? ¿Qué es litter? ¿Qué es litter? No, litter es pequeño. ¿Qué es litro? Litro. No, no. Litro. Miren cómo está escrito. Miren cómo está escrito. Tirar, no. ¿Pero tirar qué? No. ¿Basura? Yes, yes. Basura, basura. Es otra forma de decir basura, porque basura se dice trash o garbage. Mm -hmm. Basura. ¿Y qué es? Throw, teacher. ¿Cuál? Eh, you, throw, you know, tirar, you shouldn't throw. Tirar, tirar, throw. También se puede utilizar en arrojar. Sí, votar. No. Any other question? Anybody? No for me. Okay, let me explain something to you guys. Okay, in this case, uh, we usually need to advise not to do something. So, es un consejo, pero es lo opuesto, eh, es en negativo, o sea, lo que no se debe hacer. Así es como se, se, se dan consejos para eh, lo que no se debe hacer, okay? Any other questions? Okay, good. So we continue, okay? Let's move on. Continuando. Okay, and now let's practice what we learned. Practiquemos lo que acabamos de... de de aprender. If it's raining, if it's rainy, you blank take an umbrella. What is the correct answer? Two. Number one. Two. Number one. Two. one. Two. 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 Number one. Two. Yes. If it's rainy, you should take an umbrella. Todos. If it's raining, you take an umbrella. You should take an umbrella. You should take an umbrella. 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 If it is raining, you should take an umbrella. Good. Si notan ese if significa eh, opción, lo cual indica que es, estamos uh -huh. utilizando lo que llamamos. Um, Um, condicionales, condicionales. condicionales indicando que si está lloviendo tiene que llevar la sombrilla sombrilla very good all right moving on continuamos yes can you give me the pronunciation if it is o how can I say well el cual 
if, if, es que a mí se me traba un poco la lengua. ¿Cómo así, lo dice usted? Así, if, if, it's. Pero cuando lo decimos rápido. If, it, if it's. If it's. If it. If it's rainy. If it's rainy, ah, you should take okay. the umbrella. If it's raining. Yes. Okay. Don't worry, it's okay. Okay, number two. Tommy, blank, eats so many lollipops. It's bad for his teeth. Everybody? Tommy, number two. Tommy, eats so many lollipops. Wait, wait, wait. Here. Wait. Okay. Okay, so. Tommy shouldn't Tommy. eat so many lollipops. It's bad for his teeth. Todos? Tommy, Tommy shouldn't eat so many lollipops. It's bad for his teeth. I have a question. Teacher, excuse me. What is a many lollipops? Guys, what is lollipop? Du Caramelos. No, paleta de dulce. No, ¿se acuerdan de los que salían? No, no. ¿Se acuerdan de los que salían en la chilindrina? La, la que la chilindrina. Yes. Entonces, ¿Ah? Esos son lalipas. Lalipas. Okay. Ah, yeah. <laughs> ok, I have a party tonight. What blank I wear? I have a party Number tonight. One. Number, Number one. Number one. Should I wear? Number one. Should I wear? Number one. Should I wear? Should I wear? Entonces, quiere decir que esa persona está pidiendo un, una, ¿qué? Uh, sugerencia. Sugerencia. Advice. Oh, advice. Very good. So, I have a party tonight. What should I wear? What should I wear? Todos. I have a party. I wear. I wear. Okay, so very good. You have a testimonial. Stay home and study. What is the correct answer? Number three. Number three. Number three. Number three. Number three. Are you sure? Yes. Yes. Number yes. three. Yes. Yes. Yeah. yes. You have a test tomorrow. You shouldn't go to the cinema. You should mm -hmm. stay home and study. Mm -hmm. Yes. You, you have, have a test tomorrow. You should go to the cinema. You should stay home and study. Yes. You have a test tomorrow. You shouldn't go to the cinema. You should stay home and study. Okay, guys. Listen, listen, listen. Um, I know that this grammar has been extensive. Eh, sé que este, esta gramática fue extenso porque los dos modales son largos y aún lo recorté dándole solo lo más, um, lo más, um, uh, lo más sí. usado o lo más que se conoce, ¿ok? So, lo principal es que les he dado acá porque es bien extenso. So, por eso es que se nos hizo largo. Mire ya qué hora es. Um, sorry, sorry for that. My bad, my bad. Ok, so, let's move on. Children blank eat lots of vegetables, but they blank eat lots of sweets. Number three. 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 No, number four. Number four. Oh. Yes. Oh. 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 Yeah. Listen, uh -huh. children should eat ah, lots sí, of vegetables, sí, 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 but sí. they shouldn't eat lots of sweets. Al revés. Okay, todos. Y tiene sentido porque todos los niños deberían de comer bastante vegetales, pero menos chuchería, le llamamos dulces. Dulces. ¿Cómo, cómo, cómo? Lot of is the same a lot of. Is the same thing, yes. What is the difference? No a lot difference. of or lot no of? Difference. Un montón. No difference. Un montón. No hay diferencia. Siempre es un montón. Mm. Ok. It depends on me. What can I use? No, no, no. Uh, usted oh. debe... Oh, sí, exacto. Usted decide qué usar. A lot of or lots of. No problem. Ah. Solo es okay. el cambio de proposición nada más. ¿Ok? Ok. 
could y llegamos a la 1.12 knowledge check el uh, knowledge check. check instructions complete this conversation using can 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 should or shouldn't todos Ok, esto es lo que van a encontrar en la plataforma. Ojo. Juan, I blank decide to where to go on my vacation. What is the option? Okay. Can. Negative. Negative. I can't decide where to go on my vacation. Todos. I can't decide, I can't decide, decide where, where to go, go on my vacation. vacation. My vacation. Okay. B. You blank go to India. It's my favorite place to visit. Okay, good. Uh, two. Hey, I'm planning to go to Bogotá this year. What do you think I blank go? I should I'm go. I'm planning to go to Bogotá next year. When do you think I should go? Everybody? When do you think I should go to Bogotá next year? I should go to Bogotá next year. When do you think I go? And what is the answer for B? You should go anytime. The weather is nice all year. Todos? You should go anytime. You should go anytime. The weather is nice all year. Three. What is the answer for three? Should. 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 Yes. Mm -hmm. no, 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 no. 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 no, you should definitely use the subway. It's fast and efficient. Mm -hmm. So it should, should. Should. Everybody you reading? You should finally. No, you should. Wait, wait, wait. Definitely. 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 Okay. What is the uh, what is the answer for A? Ten. Ten. Yes. Where can I get? Where can I get some nice jewelry in Bangkok? Everybody. Where can I get some nice jewelry in Bangkok? What is jewelry, teacher? Jewelry. Joyería. Joyería. Very good. Okay. B. What is la B? You shouldn't. 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 You Okay, B. Sí, pero mira, no, no se para, ¿ves? ¿Ves? Mira, mira, no se está levantando, mira. You can can all of Paris. Can. 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 Can.
you can do anything. Okay, so we finish. Wrap. Okay. okay, so we finished the Wrap. section number one. So, Wrap. what did you learn in this section? What did you learn in this section? Model verbs. Use Model can. verbs. Use can and show. Use can, can and can. show. Wait, wait. Can, 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 However. However. can, Positive, oh. negative, question. Well, okay, positive and negatives. What else? And question. Okay, good. Positive question and negative question. And out of two. <laughs> okay, <laughs> tell what was what, one thing that was difficult to you. What was something okay. difficult to you? Soul shouldering. Shouldering was difficult to you? Ah, yes, a show. For me, for me, however, sure, sure. however, oh, however, however, and no, and no. Yes. Ah, uh, uh, for me, a uh, shoe, but uh, no, no polite. Ah, it's, not um, polite. Um, mm -hmm. It's very difficult to use because uh, I understand you, but uh, the practice, I believe that is, um, it could be more difficult, hard, difficult. <laughs> but no. I need to train. Wait, the thing is that you need to check how other people feel. Tiene que verificar cómo se siente la, las otras personas. Yes. Okay? Yes, that's, that's the only difference. Esa es la única diferencia. Tiene que ver con los sentimientos de terceros. Simple. Okay? Okay. Cool. Simple. Okay. Mm -hmm. How would you say the teacher presented the lesson material? ¿Cómo presentó el material el teacher? Excellent, very good, good, not bad or bad. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent. Good. Excellent. Okay, good. Um, lo único que... Excellent. Sí, por lo de la gramática de los modales, se extendió bastante porque mm -hmm. sí es grande. O sea, las explicaciones son vastas. De hecho, es, uh, hay mucho más que explorar. Ok, yeah. eso ya les queda, queda en sus manos eh, después de esto. Ok. Yes. Incluso agregarle ahí que nos estuvo explicando lo del ANG, muy bueno. Excellent. Presente continuo, presente sí. continuo, yes. Present continuo. Y esto nos okay. falta. Para la próxima semana quiero incluir, uh, I want to uh, include uh, simple future, simple past, simple present, present perfect, and past continuous. ¿Ok? Pero eso significa okay. de que lo voy a llevar apretaditos, apretaditos, apretaditos. That sounds good. That sounds good because we can learn so okay. much about this language. Very I good. Think. Okay. So, y um, para los que sabían de que el 15 de septiembre cumplí años, todavía sigo la parranda. Me estoy celebrando. Eh, ha sido bastante bien. Pensé que no iba a llegar a celebrar por lo de la pandemia, pero Yeah, everybody's like, teacher, let's go somewhere. I have been, uh, fin de semana estuve en, 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 en Zacatecas y en, eh, ahí, en esos balnearios, ¿cómo se llaman? Costa del Sol. So, mm. Wow. I don't know. Yeah. I don't know that place. Yeah, I love, I love. Let's go a party, teacher. Okay, we can we can we can make an agenda. Podemos ponerlo en agenda, no problem. Yes. You guys like to party? You guys like to party? Yeah. No les gusta el party, no? No. no. Party. Yes. Let's go a party, teacher. Let's go a party. We like to party. Okay, guys. So, ojo, tienen todo el fin de semana. Eh, van a descansar el lunes. So, nos vamos a volver a ver hasta el martes. Okay. Martes. Yeah. No te okay. cases ni te embarques. <laughs> so, you guys, okay. have a very nice weekend. Have a nice, very long weekend. And I'll see you on Tuesday. Have a nice okay. night. Okay. Thank you. Bye. 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 Have a nice night. Bye. 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 Have a nice night. Good night. Good night. Night. Good night. Good night. Good night, everyone. Good night, everyone. Good night. Be good. Be good. Take care.